So, I am going to practice the Megara Aulos. Uh, this is a, 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 well, I suppose it's me attempting to deal with the fact we've got such a big uh, span uh, between the holes. And I'm wanting to be really, really sensible um, about my tendons and ligaments and not push it too far, too fast. Um, so I'm just going to practice one pipe at a time. Um, and I'm going to experiment using various sort of stretching movements um, in order to try and uh, prevent tension from building up. So, leaving the reed cap on, I'll put one pipe to the side and limber up. A bit of stretching. I always believe it's better to prepare the body, uh, do the stretching or the yoga or whatever it is, uh, before you start, so the body is set up, before you put it under extreme stress, okay? Um, this is something that they would have done from an early age. Um, it, I have found that you, you get there, it's amazing um, the stretch, um, the way our bodies adapt to what we ask them to do, provided you don't push them too far, too fast. So, It's not getting off the hole. Um, so let's just try. I'm I'm really listening to the sound. I'm wanting to get a beautiful, beautiful, even sound on all of these. And uh, um, so that's one area of focus. And the other area of focus is not to work too hard, not to cause my, not to cause damage. Um, so I don't want to do more than about another few seconds. And I move. Yeah. So I'm moving from the root of the thumb. That's that's what works for me. Last time before I swap the pipes over. just by taking it to a different angle it changes I think it's helpful to move you really you need to you need to move otherwise rigidity and stiffness and uh, tension build up that's enough on one pipe uh, uh, that's another advantage of practicing separate pipes uh, you can rest uh, each hand um, uh, don't ask it to do too much 
uh, at a time uh, because this is really dangerous. You can really damage, uh, cause permanent damage, and that's just not worth it. So, yeah, I should really, yeah, sort of actually, yeah, I want to do that with both hands. Um, right, just a little bit of, a little bit of exercise. Whatever it is, um, I quite like this, just keeping breathing. And this one really sort of stretches the fingers out, and then I go the other way as well. Just to loosen that up. Okay, bit of a shake. Right, other hand. Now, so, feeling really rooted to the ground, loose in the knees, and, and um, gentle, gentle with the stretch, okay? way of doing this that is that doesn't require so much uh, tension. Oh that's much nicer. Yeah it requires real experimentation. You just got to look and experiment find out where is the easy place. There's a sweet spot physically. making a sound and getting the uh, getting the hand relaxed. Can't do everything at once, okay? Mm. Gently does it. Gently does it. <laughs> speak. Um, I'm having to really relax the embouchure uh, to get that seventh to, to sound. Uh, it could also be that I'm not quite covering the holes. I mean they are very ergonomically spaced. Um, uh, uh, you know that one there and then this one up on the top. It really does work. It makes total sense. <laughs> practicing you push yourself too far um, and then uh, uh, and then you maybe need, need to take a year off uh, so it's just not sensible don't um, uh, a little screen break at regular intervals but I will quite like um, to just do a little bit more on that thumb because I'm longing to get that thumb good <laughs> Okay, I'm going to leave it there. 
go back to the other one and do another little exercise. So gradually, um, gradually building up um, what I'm capable of doing. And I'm, I'm not going to rush into playing both pipes together. The danger with doing that is that uh, tension, tension builds up and you're not resting. I quite like doing this single pipe work uh, while I'm just getting acclimatised to a new unloss. <laughs> the thumb is the weak one. Christos Tertis, they're absolutely gorgeous. Um, Arundo Donex. Um, and the, it's imitation ivory um, with bronze sliders. Uh, uh, I mean, absolutely fantastic. I'm, I'm not even beginning to start moving the sliders at the moment. I just want to get my fingers used to the spaces and then, uh, I suppose, save up that excitement for later on. It's a long, long journey. 